The craft of lure making demands time, patience, and experience. But some lure makers are so good at it, what they create is truly artistic. Saltwater flies, like the beautiful ones you see here, well, you won't be able to find them at the local bait shop. These lures are custom made for friends of this man. And if you are ever lucky enough to be given one, well, <laughs> all you need to do is add water. So let's do that. It's time to take these lures out for a boat ride. Our fishing group of fathers and sons are hitching a ride aboard this, the 55-foot charter boat, the Kila Kila. This blue water trolling trip is a new adventure for the boys, and they've been looking forward to this. You know how enjoyable first-time experiences can be. This should be a good one. Okay, it's time to catch some bait. Let's get those tricked out saltwater flies in the water. Hanapa! That didn't take long. Good going, Landon. Tell you what, let's catch enough tuna for dinner before we start using them for bait. Fish on! Woohoo, how easy was that? Good going, guys. Well, that should feed all of us. Now, let's get back to business. Let's go get one for bait. So now, when we catch this bait and we catch marlin, do you want to tag it or do you want to keep it? I think we want to tag it. Tag and release? Yeah. No problem. That's if we catch a marlin. When we catch a marlin. Gotcha. Okay, that looks like a good one. And if that doesn't work, well, at least we'll have one more tuna that we can add to the dinner table. Uh-oh, <laughs> looks like we won't be seeing that small tuna on tonight's menu. Go get him, John. Captain, good going. Yeah. You called it. It's always nice to be lucky. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, we got our big fish on the line. Now let's see if we can bring it up. Hey, Jonathan. Awesome, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Strong fish, huh? Yeah. yeah it looks like 10 or inches, But gotta focus. Keep on it, man. Keep on it. <laughs> this tug of war is far from over. Man, 
man, what a fish. All right, Captain Teddy, get ready with the tag. Well, as agreed upon earlier, our plan is to tag and release. But what a thrill, and what an experience it is to see a big fish up close like this. Especially for this angler. It's John's first time on the rod with a marlin. He's never going to forget this. It's been a good day. We have a fish story to tell and a fish flag to fly. We even have fresh fish for dinner. Let's call it a day. More fun with the fathers and sons here in Kona right after you catch this.